South African Sign Language is the mother tongue of more than half a million people. But the language is not used by many outside the deaf community. By harnessing the power of technology, the app Sign Support was born. South African or any sign language is so difficult. I mean, you can see what she's, she's using her hands, she's using her face, there's gesture, there's speed, there's um, force of, and, and, and so many things that uh, the language is, is so rich, it's very difficult to, to deal with and, and, and capture and translate. So we started looking at different ways to do video on devices. We ended up on mobile devices because that's the most common device people have. Working with the deaf community, the development team found that health is a major concern. The app is designed for use in pharmacies. With a deaf person, when they walk away and they cannot communicate to me that I understand this, or they can talk it back to me, that's difficult because it leaves you as a professional very uncertain whether you've done your work or not. Um, and it leaves you with worry. How is that patient going to take the medicine when they get home? The app will, among others, provide a pharmacist with the patient's medical history. A picture is taken of the prescribed medication and then a video will play describing exactly how it must be taken. This project is extremely important. The reason for that is that within the deaf communities in South Africa, there's a lot of barriers, especially in the medical field, with doctors, day hospitals, pharmacies. The people don't understand what the medication is for. Even knowing that, if it, even if it's for headache, for headaches, they need to know the process before and after taking medication. So this app helps them to understand how to take the medication and I think that this project is extremely important especially for the deaf people in South Africa. The app will be able to run on low-end phones. The team hopes to find partners that will take the app into the market for public use. Mariska Boerta, SABC News, Cape Town.